Making shrimp scampi with executive chef Will Witt from the Rusty Scupper. Good morning. Good morning. So it's shrimp scampi day? It is National Shrimp Scampi Day. All right, how are you making your shrimp? We're going to do the uh, Rusty Scupper version. We're using 1620 shrimp. We got seven in here. Oh, wow. You have a seasoned little salt and pepper, mm -hmm. parsley. They look good. And throw some fresh garlic. Okay. You can never have enough garlic with shrimp scampi. And butter, too, right? You got half butter, lots oh. of butter. All right. What is the trick? You don't want to cook it for too long, right? You need a pinch of capers in there. Help okay, me out. a little pinch of capers. You got it. Put me to work. Some tomatoes. All right, and what else do we put and in there? Some parsley in there, a pinch uh -huh. of parsley. A uh, pinch of parsley. You got it. We got it some looks basil. so pretty. All right. And we're going to hit it with white wine and deglaze it. Oh, yeah. Can I One do that? Second. You want to hold that and I'll do the white wine? Sure, it's right okay, here. Okay, right here. Okay. All right, just a little bit. Pretty good amount. Got a quarter cup. Keep going. A man Keep after going. my own heart. There you go. There we go. That's All great. right. Woohoo! Man, that looks crazy. I bet you serve a lot of shrimp scampi, even if not shrimp scampi. scampi day. Yeah. All right. Quite what else are you putting on there? We're going to have some garlic oh, butter in oh, there. Oh, man. You've got it going on. Look at that. Oh, my gosh. You guys, it smells right wonderful. Here. Oh, everything looks so fresh and fantastic. Give it a stir. While you're cooking that, I just want to say thank you for bringing all of this. You well, have your fresh prawns over here. I mean, these are the biggest things I've ever Those seen. I'm going to bring it up so you can take a look at that. Those are crazy. This looks absolutely gorgeous. All right, so if you want to know professional shrimp scampi, the folks at the Rusty Scupper do it best. You can go there and you can find the recipe online as well. And then, of course, you can just eat that on the side if you want and drench it in butter. You can do it with your pasta, sort of however you want to make it happen. And as you're making that happen right there, Mary, you're going to give us our forecast, right? 